when you look back at your positions, how you've shifted around, etc., you talked about Martin O'Neill. What about Gerard Houllier? You said you didn't really mm -hmm. like him that much. Um, I think when with Gerard Houllier, do you know what it was? I think from having O'Neill, then I think Kevin McDonald took charge a bit. Then from being that, all I knew was that way of like English mentality of coaching and for a foreign coach to come in, I didn't really get on with foreign coaches. I didn't really like playing under them. Remy Gar the would whole, be another yeah, one. Yeah, the whole arrogance of Houllier, especially Remy Gard of like, I don't know, just their whole methods. And I think especially when Houllier come in, he brought Darren Bent. Do you know what I mean? So back then as well, it was one up front. And we still had Ashley Young. We still had Downing. Do you know what I mean? So all Brighton was coming through. Do you know what I mean? So there wasn't really anywhere to play me. Does that mm. makes sense. So I was on the bench a lot coming on and I didn't take well to that. So I was sulking all the time. And do you know what I mean? Um, remember I fell out with Gary McAllister um, as well because he used to want to joke and laugh in training. I'm like, Gary, I'm not playing. Don't, don't speak to me, basically. Do you know what I mean? That's how I was always like, basically. If you're not playing to me, don't speak to me. Mm. <laughs> Do you yeah. know what I mean? Like, well, don't be laughing honest, and yeah. joking with me like, yeah. when I'm not playing because then you're never going to play me if I'm still going to be laughing and joking with you. You're, like, you're happy to not play. So I was just um, like that. And then um, he only lasted a season, didn't he, Julio? Yeah. And then he left. But, yeah, I didn't really like um, like his methods. Sometimes I didn't know people's names either. Yeah, sometimes I didn't know people's names. And I was just like, what's going on here? Yeah. Not for me. I was I, I work best under English, British coaches. Yeah. Obviously mine on the old Northern Ireland as well, but the English uh, mentality. Hypothetical situation. If you mm. were given the opportunity to be managed by Remy Gard or Gerard Julia, who are you choosing? Gerard Julia. You would far, still choose yeah. after what you just said you would still choose Gerard Julia. Remy Hulia. Gard though was like he learned from Julia, didn't he? That's who taught Good him point, basically. Yeah. So he was like a worse Julio. So he wouldn't lie. I think if you, if you ask Jack and other players who played under him, like, wow, you're not seeing a bad manager. I don't think he's working now, is he? I think he's in Montreal. No, he is, him, he's not doing know, much. He won't, he won't get another job, mate. I, I couldn't. Why? Uh, what, what exactly? Just like, honestly, I like, when you come in, I was just like, I remember, to be fair, I remember the, the sack share award. I remember Randy Lerner comes to the training ground with the chief executive, and I said to him, like, Please give it to Kevin McDonald, please. You know, like the reserve team coach. Yeah. All the players knew him. I thought this is the best chance you're gonna have of like staying up. An English manager, like and he was like, No, Gabby, we're gonna go with Remy Garda, you know, he's really good, he's this. But obviously Randy Lerner is like an American owner and the chief mm. exec was American. I didn't really know not know the football, that makes sense. I didn't yeah. really know characters of like good managers, characters. And when you come in, Remy Garda, he was so like. Um, but I think they brought him because we had so many French players. Gotcha. That the club had brought. Yeah. Hey, you guessed there, the Marvi, Drissa, Gay, Verichu, which have, well, most of them have gone on to be like bloody world beaters, haven't they? But yeah. When they come to us, I think it was like their first season of adapting to the English league was a lot for them. So they brought Remy Garda in for that reason, I think. But even they didn't really get on with him. He was just like arrogant in training, he would stand in the corner like that. Shaking his head at the players, like, and I'm looking over to him, thinking, like, come and say something. If training's not good enough or people aren't doing what you want, come over to the manager. Mm. You know, come over and give your authority on the players and say you're not doing this right. This isn't good. Standards not good. You never do it, and don't be standing over in the corner shaking your head. And you know what I mean? Like every manager I've played under before would come over and say you're not doing this right. Have some authority of like, well, you're not gonna have the respect of the players. And he was all, didn't want players laughing in the training ground. Didn't want them laughing? No, I remember he said to Jack once, um, why are you so happy? Like, why are you so happy? And Jack's a young kid then, and he's like, what do you mean? He's like, you're always laughing. What's so funny? Why, why are you happy? Do you know, like, that arrogance of, like, so arrogant and, like, the, especially the English players, like, couldn't stand him. Like, yeah. once, and then results started becoming worse because of him, and then... He comes to the stage where he was waiting to be sacked. Do you know, like, on match days, he didn't leave his seat on the dugout when we were playing games. He was that, just waiting to be sacked. 
I know you are crazy. I know you said you like British managers. Maybe you just don't like French managers. Yeah, probably. It could be. Yeah, probably. I agree. Didn't didn't click. Crazy. I think like as well, a lot of different rules as well. You know, like I mean, English players probably not used to that. Does that make sense? A lot yeah. of rules. You like really? Do you need that rule? Do you know what I mean? You still want a bit of freedom as a player. Like I don't think there's like little rules that didn't need to be there. It's like just being controlling here, sort of power, arrogance and power. So yeah, I just think in general, yeah, I didn't didn't like 